if you want to build a high power portable power station with the small battery pack and you want to run the high power induction cooker and high power electric kettle or electric stove you have to use high power hydrogen cells so today i will make 24 volt battery pack i will use the refurbished 21 700 sony vtc6 cells that one sony vtc6 is the very high power cell which can deliver a 40 m continuous their c rating is also 6.6 c that is very very fast can charge and it can deliver a high power without any problem so seven cell will be in series for 24 volt and 10 in parallel this battery capacity will be 33 amp hour which is equivalent to 850 watt hour that is already enough for a one portable power power station can use the electric kettle can use the induction cooker yes it can use the also for rice cooker too small but powerful I will use two BMS in series, 3S and 4S. They both are balanced versions. You can see the balance resistors is there. Temporary, I will use that BMS until my one BMS arrive for the 7S. So I make the battery in 3s and 4s so it is like 7s same without any problem we will use that bms
battery is complete so here you can see this is the 3s 40 amp balance version bms and this one is 4s you can see the series connection this is actually two independent batteries 3s and 4s 12 volt and 16 volt battery packs i'm very confident on that bms because they are designed very good their overcurrent protection their low voltage protection and their short circuit protection is really very very good so i'm confident to using this one i'm already using this one in my the dyson the dyson battery pack but this one is also very very good so today i will just uh, leave it that one i will not isolate yet i will connect this one into my solar system so this will be charged using by 200 watt uh, solar panel and this is the silicon wires very very good i make the alligator clip because it's very easy to connect with the uh, connect uh, with the charge controller with the other things on my junction box so let's check the voltage voltage is 25.85 it's very very good so this was our 24 volt battery pack by sony vtc6 lithium ion cell 21700 is the cell that one and that was 7s 10p 33 amp hour total 850 watt hour battery pack with the two bms 3s and 4s so everything is good now i will connect this one with my solar system both batteries voltage was very close this one is a dyson 7s 6p same with the two bmss that one was 11 amp hour this is 33 amp hour i parallel them temporary so this is my 24 volt inverter and this is 20 amp charge controller which is show the voltage amperage by solar panel is connected with 200 watt solar panel so everything is very good perfect and i will try to on my freezer if it can handle the surge that bms is hopefully it can this is my freezer wire i connected the freezer is over there this freezer have a 1.3 kilowatt surge for safety purpose i using inside only 20 ampere fuses so nothing to worry about to power up this uh, inverter let's see and it's on ready over there yes perfect yes it can hold the sir yeah everything is good perfect i'm going to test this our battery pack this is almost 44 amp hour together with the 40 amp 40 amp bms with 2 kilowatt inverter the ac amp meter set on to 60 amp and on max amp test okay let's on the inverter hopefully everything will work our induction is on and now i'm going to crank okay i will start with 500 watt let's see maximum amp i can see 6.26 this was our 6.40 is the uh, surge of maximum let we see how much is the running condition yeah 5.60 6.26 the first starting surge was 1.5 kilowatt on 500 watt i will not increase from this one and running on 5.38 running on on 5.42 amp so this battery is capable to run 5.23 times 230 volt 
5.23 times 230. This is 1.2 kilowatt. Yes, it's good. It's working perfect. The battery voltage is very, very low. This is the battery is on. This is the output voltage. Battery is 25.2. Yeah, it's uh, okay. It can run. So this our battery pack is capable to run the induction cooker very very well perfect so everything worked perfect very good okay it's time to shut down thank you very much for watching see you until the next